DV is a new generation of switcher based on new technology. This technology is a standard IT server with a very powerful GPU board inside and of course our software which make all this processing internally. Being based on this standard IT server allows us to stack the frames. We are talking about 24 inputs, 6 out per PM. PM is our processing module. And so we stack the frames, putting them just in the same rack, connected through a 40 gig network, and that allows us to have an unlimited scalability. This gives us also the possibility to replace the copper cable, which is a limit of 10 meters, something like this, by a fiber, which is virtually no limit and so we can place any of those two boxes, any point of world, till you have a fiber between those two, those two points, you, you can make a remote production. And this remote production is based on a remote processing, which is very important because this gives us a lot of uh, possibilities also, such as making a kind of premix in the remote position and sending this premix over a 10 gig fiber. Everything is uncompressed and then we can reintegrate at home, so in the studio, more layers, more effects, more everything. Over this fiber, we also send multiviewer, which is extremely important because in live condition, of course, we have to preview pictures. We pass audio, we pass intercom, we will in the future have possibility for camera control, PTZ control, all those kind of things within the same fiber. A customer can start from a 1 p.m. system, 24 input, 6 out, with just a small panel, then he can add more PMs, giving him more inputs, more output, more processing power. At the beginning, always still in the same position, in the same studio. And after, he can increase to what we call distributed architecture. And that's very typically the media city market, the campus market, big buildings for big broadcasters having studios in different floors in their buildings. And it, later on, you can even go to remote. So from 100 kilometers onward, we are in what we call the remote mode, which is really no limit of, uh, of distance.